over the years, Cameroonian artists have been bullied. They have been criticized a lot, a lot of negative feedback. Um, and this time we have a blogger who is speaking up about one thing which they feel like Cameroonian artists are running short of, comparing Cameroon as it's always done to the Nigerian entertainment world. We're going to be talking about that, we're going to be reacting to that and so much more. Stay tuned. Hi guys and welcome to another edition of Celebrity Update. So um, this time around we're going to be reacting to a post from the blogger Sir Akuchu. So he said this right. 2018 to 2020 Bonaboy get three complete album out here with about 24 official music videos. But our A-list artists for PE then get not two or three videos there. Eh? I'm not sure we are ready for this business. Yeah the kind talk we then go give you back. Cameroonians are not supportive. Okay first let's break this down first because I feel like like there's there's a reason why Bona Boy has all the songs and projects coming up. Let's first of all look at the financial part of it. So first of all, Bona Boy is signed to this huge record label that is Atlantic Records, and this is a record label who has other artists like Cardi B, Kodak Black, and so many others. Why don't we? So many other big big names on the right. We know that in order for you to be able to produce whatever albums you're producing or whatever number of music videos you're producing, you need the money. I, I think this is one of the reasons why some of our artists don't have this huge amount of projects out there. Might be the fact that true in order to have this amount of projects out there, the hard work is also essential. But there's a reason why you have artists like Blanche Bailey and artists like Daphne. Daphne producing putting out more projects than Blanche Bailey. Blanche Bailey, she is independent, she does everything by herself. Um, Daphne, which has this huge record level behind her, right? Relative to Cameroon, like Steven's music is one of the biggest out there. Mr. Leo leaving Alpha Beta Records and not having as many projects as he had back then. There's a reason for all of these things right so there's a reason why you have mostly artists who are signed to record labels producing songs and music videos than independent artists this is because the financial part is highly highly essential you cannot even put a project out the way that you don't have the network to get it like far and wide all over the world and stuff like that well distributed really really well right there's a reason why after local left big dreams his number of songs and number of music videos have actually reduced a record level behind you with the finance with the network with the distribution power it's like something which really you need to put in account when you're comparing artists so look at Bonaboy and looking at our A-list artists we have Jovi we have Stanley Eno and all these artists these are people who had to create their own record levels um Salatiel his own thing so these are people who are trying to do things by themselves gradually they are coming up and they are trying to get like sponsors and stuff like that but it's like I, I saw some of the comments where like it's a gradual process and so I think like comparing Bonaboy and our A-list artists it's not fair I saw a lot of people commenting like Bonaboy has been in the industry industry as is still upcoming and stuff like that true Bonobo has been in the industry for a really long time so he has had a lot of time to really be working on this project because the fact that an artist released a song um to yesterday doesn't mean that he wrote that song yesterday so when you're looking at this three years period it doesn't mean that Bonaboy wrote these songs in this three years period no he didn't write all of the songs in this three years period he has actually been working on this project for a long time because he has been in the industry for a longer period of time so i think these are some of the things we need to put into account true 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 our artists need to put in more work i remember um when tiktok came out during the corona period and a lot of our artists jumped on tiktok and we had with andrina link coming up to say like all oh, these artists getting on tiktok um you guys need to be hitting the studios because you have to produce music videos i want to let this quarantine finish and you wouldn't have put up um songs for us when this is the time when you need to be hitting the studios instead of your own social media platforms and stuff true i do believe our artists could put more work in this stuff and we're talking to some artists old in days artists and them saying like they used to be in the studio from 3 a.m to god knows when right but our artists don't really put in that length of time into their craft anymore so i think our artists need to be doing that but we should not also ignore the fact financial part of it because the fact that Salatio has not put out the three albums doesn't mean he doesn't have the three albums but you need to be strategic about these things you need to put it in such a way that like for example you can spread out and put three albums and you are trying to promote all of the 
these albums at once but you don't do it well because you are doing it alone you are, have limited resources and everything is spread out and nothing is done well but this is Bonabolo has a huge team behind him like a lot of times we compare ourselves to Nigeria but failing to understand the power behind the Nigerian entertainment industry it's a lot more finance put into it pumped into it than the Cameroon entertainment industry true there are a lot of things which you need to work on like our, our artists I feel like a lot of times there's not this um, enough professionalism there needs to be more professionalism put into their craft but I really do think our artists are doing a lot and we need to give them their accolades well deserved accolades and also when we are making comparison we need to be very aware of the fact that they are all they are different um, parameters different factors which put come in play in order to make somebody successful or make somebody release a lot of projects um, some of the comments said on oh, this is it's just going to be happening in time right we can compare all we want to but it's just time that's going to really step up things and bring out more projects and whatever but let me know in the comments below what do you think about this what do you think about say i statement um are you for the fact that Cameroon artists need to work harder or are you for the fact that they need more time let us know in the comments below thanks for watching see you guys next time it's been a town checker tv where craziness was strategy